Hello and welcome to my Amphibie Crochet channel. Today we're going to talk about Earth Day because today is Earth Day. Happy Earth Day! Let's take a look at some awesome Earth Day crochet patterns. And as you can imagine, there's going to be a lot of planets with continents in there. This is uh, a nice big one, as you can could tell with the uh, uh, hand holding it up. It's quite uh, detailed with Africa and everything. Of course, the rest of the world is on the other side. Um, but it's very nice and uh, and uh, and quite big as is this uh, sort of graph can um a bit i love that the colors of the continent are in muddled sort of muddled green different kind of of hues and uh, they didn't forget new zealand that's something huh <laughs> not every map can boast that so if you are ambitious and uh, want to crochet the world let's go for it Pro here's a bit of a more of a modest approach um i think this one is free from re free pattern from repeat crafter me and she made she used this sort of pattern you can use it for different things she used it as a um sort of uh template uh earth for a silent book as you can tell sort of silent book here she has a whole series of patterns of that silent book on her uh, crochet um, uh, website so um, uh, definitely take a look uh, at that if you want to but she also so here you can this is page one of the silent book using the earth there there's a bit more better photo but you can also use it as a um, well, for this amigurumi figure, I suppose, and you make two of them and you sew them together and make them into a little amigurumi earth. Very nice. A completely different approach is this Mother Earth um, figure um, holding the, the world in her lap and uh, hopefully taking good care of it. Now, this massive globe is, uh, you can crochet it in a big yarn and get a massive ball. But you, uh, sort of a ball pillow <laughs> but you can also crochet it in small um, and then you can get a smaller uh, type Australia is gorgeous there beautiful good for your uh, geography knowledge I suppose and here's a hat <laughs> it has a happy face on it but you can also make a little heart uh, in the place that you live at <laughs> this is a fun, a fun idea here's a little earth um, the smaller you get with these uh, globes, uh, the, the less accurate they get, obviously. I mean, Africa is a massive continent, so you can easily um, uh, recognize it. But uh, usually the bigger you get, uh, the more stitching you, 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 stitches are used, the more... Um, the, the specific it is here's a different approach. It's just basically just a blue ball with um, some uh, uh, stitching sewn on it's a different kind of approach i'm not sure i think these are the the, the clouds of so, so i don't know what the white uh, things are but it's uh it's a different way if you if you're not into the fair isle crochet you're crocheting the two colors together you can also try this approach it's a it's a fun project here's another small one uh this is north and south america i suppose and the other the, the atlantic is very happy <laughs> the atlantic ocean is very happy to see us with a sweet kawaii smile and here's africa and the rest of asia australia so very nice i live around there i think <laughs> I can see my home from here. So here's the more of an alien or sort of slash astronaut approach in the in the flat Earth. This is a bit America centered, but uh, no less fun. Uh, and you get all these fun um, uh, applique patterns. Here's another uh, Grafgan crochet for the very happy Earth, uh, kawaii style. Very very cute. And here's a more of an oval. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oval shaped um earth very cute again my my home is somewhere um near the finger i reckon <laughs> i don't know um another astronaut style uh, approach um this was the reason why i put it in here there's not a very 
good photo of it. Maybe I can zoom in for a bit. There we are. No, it doesn't make it better. Let's see. But uh, it's a fun uh, kids Afghan, I suppose, with some aliens and some planets and asteroids. And here's the, uh, I don't know what sign it is, but uh, you can ad adjust it to fit the sign of the child that you make this for or for yourself. Astronauts and rockets. It's a fun, fun thing. Look at it. It's very cute. <laughs> and this one has a different approach. What it does is you make two different halves and then you sew them together. And those halves are mm, quite complicated made. So you make them into these little flaps that you sew together. So it's not crocheted in uh, as a circle, but rather as a more of as a, f uh, a straight on um and it gives a little bit of a wonky earth but no less fun here's another one um that has like antarctica on it very nice australia with all the um all the the islands of indonesia and everything i think my home is right there <laughs> you can't help but find your home isn't it this is completely different this is a turtle with the with the the world on a sheet it's a globe twice twice i can even pronounce it. it's pathetic but you get the idea it's a fun little amigurumi animal with the with the with the world on its shield <laughs> so it's nice here's a mug cozy um with a little button to fasten it and uh uh well you have the world in your hands and in your cup of coffee beautiful very nice i like the it's, it's, it has a very sleek and uh, style to it. Now here's a, the earth in different colors. Um, there's no need to use the, the boring uh, blue and green. Why not just use gray and pink or whatever color that you prefer. It's a nice size also. Gives a, enough uh, detail to make things recognizable. And here, if you, Earth is not enough for you, you can have the whole solar system here with the different planets, uh, massive planets, smaller planets. And this one is uh, probably the sun and uh, number three is Earth. Very fun. Now you can see how small Earth is compared to some of the bigger ones. Um, small enough not to actually have <laughs> recognizable... Um, uh, continents but uh, the blue uh, the blue planet thing is uh, very clear this one is very nice the kid is cute as well but we're focusing on the uh, on the earth here nicely detailed not too big and uh, should work up fairly quite fairly quickly and that's it for the earth day pattern roundup i wish you a happy earth day please be careful with our earth and uh Crochet this for the for the for the person in your life that either likes uh, space and astronauts or just loves to look at Earth and find their home <laughs> on a crocheted globe. I wish you happy crocheting.